I'd worry less about Canada's curves and more about your own curves, Benjamin. <laughs> Shouldn't be happening. From what I hear, they copied the design from us, sir. Well, how on earth did they get the blueprint, Carl? I, I don't know, sir, but I'll tell you what. If you're worried about people stealing your data, no. And you want to protect yourself from outside threats. Don't you dare. Then you, my friend. If you mention NordVPN, I'll scream. Should use NordVPN. <laughs> oh, you better believe that's a crucifixion. Send home the booty. Oh, but I want to stay. No, Steve, not you. They mean the treasure. Well, we are not watching any more of this filth. So the other console left with the booty. It enraged his father, but by this time he was an old-ass man, so he just sort of let it go. And then died of a lung hemorrhage. Th I'm gonna shove that camera up your ass. Send that to the colonies. Your majesty, your handwriting is terrible. Are you sure? Just do it. What does it say? He's gonna... Lick my... Gross. So for the remainder of the year, small engagements continued to occur around the colony. This enraged Adel's father, who punished him severely. Just me and my beloved potatoes. I'm so happy. Say, Lyman, them some nice spuds you got there. Would be a shame if somebody ate them. No, not again, you beast. Leave my potatoes alone. Yeah, I'm gonna eat them, Lyman. I'll eat them. And then I'm gonna eat you. Stay back. I'll shoot! Go ahead, punk. Make my day. Shoot me! Shoot me! But what kind of haircut am I giving you? Let's go with... Bold. Hello, good sir. We request to speak with your leader. Uh, Out of my way! Allow me to parlay with this foul beast. <clears throat> Threatening my sheep. You can't have that thing. Okay, you can have that thing, but no more. I want that thing. And repeat. I'm talking lawyers extraordinaire Johnny A and Johnny J, experienced military commander George Washington, businessman and future alcoholic beverage Samuel Adams, fiery orator Patty H, guy who married a rich lady Big J Dickinson. Hey, Big Papa! My boy Henry says he wants to divorce his wife. Any chance? Congratulations, it's a general. Oh, and here comes the rest of the army now. Uh, did you just say the rest of the army? Oh no, please don't hurt me. I won't hesitate to shoot. Please, I have a wife and kids. Hand over all the whiskey, fatty. Hey, fatty isn't in the script, you jerk. <laughs> Mere miles from Carthage. You sure are amazing. Yes, Steve, I know. <sighs> Steve, what's the matter? We've almost won. I just wish I could be as great as you, Regulus. Steve, you're amazing. I mean, Look at this thing! It's unbelievable! I know! Hey guys, looks like the Romans are coming straight for us this time. And what will they do when they get here? They'll kill us all. <gasps> They'll massacre each and every last one of us. They may even chop our pets in half. That's barbaric! No, Rob, it's actually pretty normal for the time. We'd do the same to them. Who'll protect us? Funny you should ask, Mary. That's kind of why I called this meeting. Who will protect us? Protect our families. Our homes. Our children. You guys? Ha! Don't make me laugh. Why, you're just a bunch of stupid and weak farmers. Simple-minded buffoons. Cowards. Fools. Rob here thinks enslaving women and children is barbaric. You're a snowflake, Rob. Yes, you are. The fact is, if the Romans manage to land on African soil, we're all gonna die. A terrifying, hideous, unspeakably painful death.
Is that the end of that speech? Yes. Man who imagines being strangled by a tarantula while a kangaroo breaks his kneecaps and thinks, mmm, yes please. For the man who pictures himself being eaten by a snake in the burning outback while eating a Vegemite sandwich and thinks, mmm, yes please. Similarly saw a dingo being eaten by a crocodile, being eaten by a death adder, being eaten by a koala, being eaten by Mel Gibson, and yes, good.